Do you like listening to the Pandora internet radio service, but wish you didn't have to use the browser in Linux? Well, I've got the solution. Hey everyone, what's happening? Today we're going over a desktop application that allows you to listen to the Pandora internet radio service. Now, a lot of people just listen to their browser, but your browser sometimes takes up a lot of CPU cycles and memory, etc. So uh, this is often can be a better solution for a lot of people. So we're going to go ahead and jump over and uh, get this installed, and it's called Pythos. Quite a few options, actually. So we're just going to go ahead and take a look at here. Here's the, actually the GitHub. Uh, repository right here so you can build it from source if you want you it's also for your arch users it's also available in the AUR and also it's available um, as a flat pack as well on Flathub. so those are all options but also in Ubuntu who based distributions? It's also in the Ubuntu base uh, in the Ubuntu repository. So it's a sudo apt install pythos, or you can search it in your app store as well. So you can so you so you've got a number of options, and it being in flat and it being in flat hub, it will work on any distribution whatsoever that supports flat packs, which is pretty much all of them these days. And I bet you, you could probably find an, an app image someone's built, but I wouldn't suggest that. I'd only suggest the official ones, which is the AUR, the GitHub, and the Flatpak, and the ones provided by your distribution. So, now that we've got that installed, we're going to go ahead to sound and video right here. And we're going to go all the way down to Pissos right here. And then... As you can see, I've already had it installed once. We're just going. We're not going to um, play any music because, of course, copyright strikes. But basically, you got your play button, your your fast forward, and your mute button, and you've got your uh, playlist right here. It tells you what it's what uh what it's going to play. You've got your radio stations here as well so I mean you can change whatever radio station you want as well so it's a really simple app it's a GTK app so it's works well with cinnamon gnome etc it's a real simple app um, now uh, you also have your preferences right here now if you are subscribed to Pandora Run when you sign in uh, you can go ahead and check that box right there. But I'm not subscribed to Pandora 1. You can also set it up for audio quality. Uh, it should be set to high. And what proxies you want to want to run it through if you're using a proxy. You can also have like a screensaver, pause on, notify, all this other stuff here in plugins, the additional options. It's really, really simple to run. Uh, of course, you got you can also hit stations right here, and you can uncheck whatever you want to show in your list right here. You can also go, this is also where you add your stations, just like on your Pandora account. Now, also a little secret about Pythos. I'm not subscribed to Pandora One, which is their premium service. And I still, and I have never ever heard an ad if I use this client. Never. And that's only supposed to be Pandora one uh, specific. So, uh, added perk, I guess, to using this client. I love this client. It's simple, it's easy, and it gets the job done. I just wanted to introduce you to the boss here. This is the boss. This is Hannah, the boss of my YouTube channel. I love her, and I think she's ready for me to let her go. So I'm gonna let her go. 
So that was the Pythos app. It's really just a simple app that does one simple thing, and it doesn't have a lot of bloat. It's just a radio app. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it that thumbs up. If you don't, that's what the thumbs down button is for. And go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next one. If you like my content and wish to support my work, you can do so on Patreon. The link is in the description. Also, if you wish to see more, check out the videos on your screen.